when you have a glass of milk, you need to consider where that comes from, right? Cows are mammals like us. They only produce milk when they have children. So in order to have that glass of milk, the cow needs to be forcibly impregnated after the semen has been got from a bull. Right? Then that cow gives birth to a calf. But that calf is going to want that milk, right? That milk is produced for the calf. So what happens to the calf? Well, the calf is taken away. Right? The calf has to be taken away from its mother, which causes the same kind of psychological distress as it would do if you did it to a human being. And you can see it happen. You can watch that cow being separated from its mother. And not only do you see distress, but you also see confusion. They just don't get what's going on. Why are you taking my child away from me? And remember that we're doing this so that we can have milk in our coffee and our cereal. Right? This cow will be continually impregnated, continually give birth to children. Those children will be continually taken away. And the thanks that we give to that cow when it's finally given all its milk is to kill it for food. If you go into Costa or into Starbucks or into Cafe Nero and you say, I'll have a latte, all of this happens on your dime. But if you just add one extra word, you say, I'll have a soy latte, I'll have an oat latte, I'll have an almond latte, one of the endless milks that now exist. All of that disappears. Right? Your name is no longer attached to that immorality. It's gone. You're no longer responsible. It's as simple as that, right? 